Hey, welcome back to another TTM video, everybody. We're getting autographs. TTM through the mail. We've got 10 today. We didn't have a video on Monday. Cutting straight to Thursday. Little backup. That's why we have 10. Let's get started. Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, first up. Getting autographs. TTM through the mail. We send our favorite athletes and celebrities cards, photographs through the mail. When they come back from Elroy Face, we celebrate and we share the good news with all of you out there. That 63 Fleer we saw recently on a uh, mail day video. And then we threw that 89 Swell on there. And sending $5, I believe. We always send Elroy a donation. 95 years old. Been a great signer for years and years. And finally starting to get to some of the recognition he's due. Pirates just inducted him into their team Hall of Fame only the second year. That Hall of Fame has been in existence, so he was in the second cl class at age 95. But just to revolutionize the relief pitcher position, six times an All-Star 1960 World Series champ where he saved three of those four games. And first ever to save 20-plus games more than one time. Led the league three times and was second three other times. Always quick return. I think he does one for free. I sent two cards and five dollars. Seven days. Your results may vary. Seven days. Elroy Face. One of the greatest. Hartford, Connecticut up next. Didn't trust my Dollar Tree envelopes. I think I have three today. Didn't trust my Dollar Tree envelopes. Big piece of tape there. From Hartford, Connecticut. Linda Ruth Tosetti. How about that? Been waiting a while for that one. There's two Babe Ruth cards. I know some of you aren't into this, but I like it. Have these Babe Ruth cards sitting around her. Get some ink from his granddaughter. From his only biological daughter. His granddaughter, Linda Ruto, said he's kind of making a purpose to spread the news of Babe Ruth about his career and his life. And she's really trying to get number three retired from Major League Baseball. But pretty cool. The GOAT, Babe Ruth. Best baseball player of all time. I'll take his granddaughter's autograph. Linda Ruth to City. Austin, Texas. Real Grand District up next. Austin, Texas. We've got 10 to burn through today. Let's get to it. Louis Kelcher. Big man. There's his rookie, 78. Saw this on a recent Mail Day video as well. Louis Kelcher's another guy with quick returns. We like that 78 rookie. Here. And there's the 79 second year. Big guy, big guy. 6'5", 282 there. Got up to at least 300 pounds, I'd say, during his playing days. War size 17 quadruple E shoes. He's 70 years old. Played 10 seasons, 75 to 84. First nine with the Chargers, and then 49ers, his final season. And he ended up winning a, a Super Bowl ring, Super Bowl 19. Solid, solid player. Dominant at times because of his size which back then in the 70s and early 80s was huge anymore. That's just a typical defensive tackle. But back then he was huge and he could move three times in the Pro Bowl. He's in the Chargers 40th anniversary team, 50th anniversary team, and in their team's Hall of Fame. Speaking of his buddy, his fellow Hall of Famer Elroy Face right there. 14, 15, 16, 17 days. No fee for Louis Kelcher. And we forgot to say what Linda Ruth said he was. Hold on just a moment. Let's get back to that one. Right there. Exactly 40 days. 40 days. That's the longest. We've sent to her two or three times now. That's the longest one she's had. And boom, another guy. Didn't trust our Dollar Tree envelope with a huge piece. This one's coming from San Diego, California. We've got a good idea who this one is. And it could be a Hall of Famer. It is on the rookie card. We've seen this. This is not the one from Jim G that we saw, um, let's see, the last Wednesday. We went through that Fuel and Fire pack, and he sent us a James Lofton 79 rookie, and I think I may have mentioned that I already had one out to James Lofton, and that's it. $10 for a Hall of Famer on a rookie card. Pretty sweet deal. Little wax stain back there, no problem. Hall of Fame 03, 2023. He always writes the year he signs. And that's pretty sweet. We like getting um, 
James Lofton. And I got the other card that Jim G sent us. I'll be sending that out soon too. As I always say, if they don't, if they don't have a fee, I generally wait six months before I send them out again. But if they have a fee, I go right back to them. That's what they're there for. That's what they earn. How they earn part of their income. But yeah, great player there. Eight times in the Pro Bowl for 67-year-old James Lofton. 1980s All-Decade team. 14,000 receiving yards in his career. 75 touchdowns. Great player. He does have a $10 fee, but he's a quick returner. Got a great legible autograph. Very neat. And he signs his rookie card for the same price, so no additional fees there. Just a per good guy to send to. And that's 10 days, 11, 12 days, 12 days, James Lawton, $10 fee. Hall of Famer. Me on me, Flirt to Florida. Flirt to Florida up next. Flirt to Florida. Don't know who it is. Louis Pujols. Boy, that's hard. <laughs> Can't barely recognize that, but that's two index cards. Pretty sweet. We always send the index cards for backing and support in the envelope. If we get them signed, it's icing on the cake. Got a little run here. 82, 83, and 84. Louis Pujols. Cousin of Albert Pujols, the future Hall of Famer. And he also played in Charleston in Triple A. Triple A Pirates for a long time. Then they stopped in 76. And I think the following year, 77, is when Pujols played here. And also played in 78 and 79, Charleston, West Virginia, trip away for the Astros. Don't block those babes. Don't block that 63 fear either. Became a long-time coach after his playing days. That's exactly two weeks there. 14 days, no fee. Louis Pools, cousin of Albert. Traverse City, Michigan. Traverse City, Michigan. Up next. Traverse City Meat Chicken. Dan Deerdorf again on the rookie 73. Nice looking autograph. Again, got a fee going back at him. Just got him a couple months ago, probably, on the rookie card. Just go get him again. Especially for a guy who didn't sign regularly for a long period of time. Then he sent out a fee schedule. Saw someone posted on the Facebook groups. And I thought, well, let's give it a shot. If he's putting, if he's telling what to pay, then he must want to. Contribute. That's the second time we've sent that rookie card. 73 tops. $10. Hall of Famer. Six times in the Pro Bowl for Deerdorf. Eight for Lofton. He's on the 1970s All-Decade team. Always check out those All-Decade teams for Hall of Famers and future Hall of Famers. And he's in the both the College Football Hall of Fame and the Pro Football Hall of Fame. Just under two weeks there. 13 days. 13 days. $10 fee for Lofton and Deerdorf so far. Yeah, nice. Miami, Florida, Florida. Miami, Florida, Florida. Ooh, got something in here. AJ Dewey. What did he send? Well, just some some backing, some support for the card so they don't get damaged. That's pretty cool. First time we sent to AJ Dewey. Nice rookie card there, 78. Beautiful 85, of course, in the 79 second year. First time we've sent to him. Always heard he has a fee. He's one for five, and I believe he's three for ten. That's what I sent. Three for ten. Got them all signed. Now, someone posted that he'll sign as many as you want to for ten dollars, but I wasn't about to risk that. I just sent three and ten, including that rookie. I've got another 78 rookie somewhere. I want to send to him again. He was a really solid player back in his day. A.J. Dewey. Nice. The Pro Bowl in 84. NFL Defensive Rookie of the Year in 77. And the Dolphins Wall of Fame 2012. I did send three cards and $10. Nice. And this one, there's uh, no postmark, but I think it's coming from, oh, Canada. Didn't trust my Dollar Tree envelope there either. It's got three stamps on the front. That's why I say it's probably from Canada. And that's Bill Mickelson. And that's not his rookie card, I don't believe. I think his rookie card was 71 or 72. Early, very early in his career. 
pretty solid player. And he came from a long family. His uncle played. His brother played. His son played professional hockey. His daughter even played for the Canadian national team. Won a couple gold medals there. So Bill Mickelson, he's 75 years old. He's a defensive he Played eight seasons, 70 to 77. And thank you very much, your fan, Michael Myers. And here I am, you are welcome, Bill. That's pretty cool. I got to count that as a half, I guess. One and a half out of one. Boom. You are welcome, Bill. Nice. All in all, about a month out into Canada. Just under a month. 20, 29 days. 29 days. The rookie card is the 72-73. This is the 73-74. So second year card for Bill Mickelson there. Got his rookie card signed the last time. North Houston, Dallas. North Houston, Texas. No hard card in here. Bob Aspermonte. Who did we see get him back? Johnny Serena got him back on um, Tuesday, I believe. There's the 61 tops. Or 62, I mean. 63. And then that 66 with Rusty Staub, La Grande Orange. He's no longer with us, so that card will be put to bed. No longer signing that with any live ink. Bad boss, but Aspro the Astro, they called him. Because he was a legendary Houston Astro. There he is on the Colt 45s. Taking in the expansion draft. He's on the Brooklyn Dodgers. Whoa, that's got some ink there. You can see back in 56, he had won at bat for the Brooklyn Dodgers. Sent down to the minor leagues and came back in 60 in the pros. And by that time, the Brooklyn Dodgers had moved to L.A., L.A. Dodgers, and then he was ex taken in the expansion draft by the Colt 45s. Pretty cool. Aspro the Astro. He and his brother Ken are both great signers. Played the Astros seven years, 62 to 68. He's in the Astros Hall of Fame. Two weeks, no fee. Bob Aspermonte. 13 days. 13 days, no fee. D.B. Daniels, New Jersey up next. D.B. Daniels, New Jersey. Bye bye bye, Boney rookie card. Andre Robertson signs for a fee, I believe. Small fee, five dollars. I signed for free before. And then Andy McGaffigan, I guess I have to wait for a private sign if I want to get those signed. But the second time, I think we've gotten bye bye on his 82 tops rookie stars. And we'll put that over here. Block Louis Kelcher's rookie. That looks pretty cool. He has a one per, one max. For Bye Bye Baboni, the prodigious power. Played nine seasons in the minor leagues and led the league six times in home runs. Couldn't wait for him to get up in the Yankees and start blasting home runs with them. But he was also a big strikeout guy, too. So, first base DH. A little glare there. There you go. So, what do you think? That's 10, 10 big ones. Bye bye, Baboni. 13 seasons, 81 to 93. He won a World Series ring in 85 with the Royals. And a longtime coach after his playing days. Baboni, under three weeks, 18 days, no fee. He is a strict one per. So tell me what you think down below. As always, I love to read your comments. I read all of them. If you haven't subscribed yet, we try to do these twice a week. Now, this is the second week on row. We've only done one of these TTM videos. I've got to get back on track. We try to do them on Mondays and Thursdays. Do something fun on Wednesday, as you saw yesterday. And then on Friday, we do our big mail day video. So subscribe there and then click that bell and ring all. That way you'll be notified any future video that I post. And if you missed last Thursday's TTM video, I'll leave a link to that one right there. Thanks for being with me today, though. We will see you soon.